Hey guys, so, um, I'm here to make a, hi Vigira, yeah, new cat, um, I'm here to make a Deadpool review, movie, review of course, I've done the game version, well, it's more of a skit, but you get it, um, so, I'll get to the point, uh, so yesterday I went to see Deadpool, for the first time, and this is gonna be a very honest, 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 opinion about the movie um see I like that pull I like the I I like that pull movie had its perks it 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 could be good it could be good it was good but I have a lot of problems with it and it starts with the first one Starts with my first problem of the movie. Oh, and I will be getting into why I liked it eventually, but I'll start with the negatives and I'll go into the positives. Because, yeah. The first negative I have with it is that all the trailers that we saw... Now, you know, a lot of fanboys are... Everybody. A lot of people are... Comp it's almost like people forgot about the... Um, about the trailers because... It starts off with the test footage. I'm, there's not going to be any spoilers. It starts off with what we saw in the test footage and what we saw in the trailers. You know, the, the highway scene, him singing and all that. And then you go on to more trailers and it's the Christmas Day one. And then you see kind of the action sequence of the end scene. Yeah, the scenes were great when Deadpool was there. But the problem is, like, and this was gonna, this was my fear that they were gonna, oh, look at my, I just woke up. Um, the problem is that, um, almost 70% of the jokes that were in the trailers are in the movie. You know, everybody was laughing, it's great and all, but I felt like the new stuff that I hadn't seen was mainly Ryan Reynolds. Now I mean there were still jokes. I mean at the beginning you had you know Ryan Reynolds who what didn't look ugly, you know. This is not a spoiler cuz you know um it's an origin story and you should know that if you're going into this review. Um my point is being well, yeah, he, he he was Deadpool, and then he became angry and all that, and which is normal. Uh, but in a sense, it... What I guess I'm trying to say is that the movie didn't cut out for me. Uh, and I felt like the romantic aspect was pointless. Uh, I know that... I know where they were trying to go with it, but my problem with the movie is that I felt personally that I, it didn't know what it wanted to be, whether it was a romantic movie or a Deadpool movie, and by Deadpool movie, an insane, crazy, all over the place. Like I said, the Deadpool scenes were great, but when Ryan Reynolds was Ryan Reynolds, a after he, you know, got burnt and everything, he... I don't know how to put this. It he went from Deadpool to Van Wilder in two point zero seconds, or uh, the just friends version. Uh, if you haven't seen that, I suggest it because it's so funny. But he became the just friends version. It's just like there's some roles that he couldn't let go. Um, and then you have well, when he's in the suit, he's Deadpool. I think there was like one or two scenes after he got burnt. Where he was still Deadpool afterwards. I mean, um, once that romance really kicked in, after he got burned, I felt. I don't know. I personally, a lot of people are gonna hate me for saying this, but Man of Steel will always be my favorite superhero movie. It will always be my favorite superhero movie because even before the fact of Batman v Superman, you guys know this. I absolutely love the movie. 
I, I feel I personally feel like it's got great storytelling and all that stuff. Anyways, I like that Superman. I don't. I don't ever like Superman. I was into that. Uh, the action was great and everything. Maybe because I hardly saw any trailers. I saw one. But then you have Deadpool, where yeah, I get they were trying to advertise and everything. But personally, me after after I saw the first thing of Deadpool. I was down. I was all for it. And then people started hyping it. Yeah, I get it. The movie was good. But because it was too hyped for me, I went in with high expectations and I was poorly disappointed because I was very critical. I went in critically and... For any of those who have not watched the trailer, which I doubt you haven't, yeah, you're going to love... You're still going to... Like... I don't know what it is. I've noticed people who... People still... Praise... This. I mean... I want to see a sequel, yes. But the big problem is... The mask was taken off 50% of the movie. Well, not 50%, but a lot of the movie. You know? I still wanted to see... I wanted to see the mask on... More than it was. I mean, it was on a lot, but... Because of the trailers, I felt like I was seeing more Ryan Reynolds than Deadpool. That's what I'm trying to say. So, without that further ado, my rating for Deadpool is 7 out of 10. Deadpool scenes were great. Um, the action was great when it's there. The comedy, oh my gosh. The comedy, yes, it's funny. Now, now that this origin story is gone, maybe the second one will be better. To be honest with you, I want the second one to come out because I want now to see more Deadpool. Now, I, f- I probably, maybe because it was an origin story, it, you know, we can get past the mask being taken off too much. That's the problem with a lot of masked heroes. That was my problem with Kylo Ren. I liked Star Wars a whole lot more. Star Wars Episode Seven, I liked it so much more than Deadpool. I can admit that. Does it? That was a much better made film. I guess I get that it's a different universe, but movie wise, I liked Star Wars a lot better. I liked uh, Days of Future Past better. I don't know. I'm weird that way. I like movies that other people probably won't like. Anyways, so that is my Deadpool movie review. I want you to take in mind don't not not go see this movie. Go support it. I mean, yeah, let's get a sequel. So, already been confirmed. That Stay after the end credits, though. The end credits are funny. They're funny, funny. Um, and no, it's not two. It's like one, but cut up in two. It's like halfway through that uh, end credit, you have um, words and then continues. Stay. You have to stay. There's. It's not that... Um, it's not that the end scene credit goes into the X-Men universe. It's just it's just hats off to an 80s movie. It's just great. Great, 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 great. All right. Well, I hope you enjoyed my Deadpool review. Um, one last thing I got to say about it is that I personally do regret going to the theater to see it. I get to support this movie. You have to go to the theater. I would have just bought the Blu-ray. I would have been content with that. I started getting doubts more towards the, uh, I was getting close to the movie. Uh, if you want to see a Batman v Superman tr- uh, re- movie review, let me know. I will more than likely do one because I did Man of Steel. I might as well do that. Um, but yo, like, subscribe, comment. Um, I am going to try. I'm going to try to do so many great things in life. Oh yeah, and Suicide Squad also. Because it's in that same universe. And when I keep up the movie reviews of those universes, I won't. I, I did Deadpool because I did the game. Go check that out. Alright. S- see you later. Bye.